Good morning, Fai. Good morning, Mr. Ogawa. Remember, guess who? Yes. Did you have a teacher who made a lifelong impact? A particular math teacher, I don't know why, he told me to memorise Pi as much as I could and I can still do it somehow. That was when I was 14, 15. There you go. So that, that's what I'm up to. Wow, that is impressive. I particularly remember one of my teachers who used to be able to draw a perfect circle on the chalkboard and he used to centre it and then just draw the perfect circle and I can just remember going. He used to wear two watches all the time so there was always something quirky about what he did. One of which was analogue and the other one was digital and he would use that to illustrate mathematical ideas. RESOLVE is a national program developed by the Australian Academy of Science and the Australian Association of Mathematics Teachers and funded by the Australian Government Department of Education and Training, promoting a spirit of inquiry in school mathematics. What? Blue hair, red eyes. Nathaniel, did you say you just did red, red? Red hair or angry? The RESOLVE program is unique because it got both resources and people. It provides resources for teachers ready for the classroom, plus people to promote and share those resources through Champions of Resolve. Each resource has um, a lot of knowledge behind it and it's embedded in the program. Takashi, through his training and knowledge of the Resolve It program, has been sharing those strategies with staff and showing them how to present the open-ended activities and really making sure that people are confident that they can use these sorts of activities and even though they're fun and very engaging they're assured that they are teaching curriculum outcomes. At the heart of the program is the Resolve Protocol, making mathematics purposeful. The tasks are challenging yet accessible, creating classrooms with a knowledge building culture. There are now more than 250 Resolve Champions across Australia. They're committed to their students, they're committed to teaching mathematics better and to helping other people to teach it better. So we're going to do some mind reading today. Write down a two-digit number whose digits are different. Each champion is given a 12-month program of professional development. Teachers trial and give feedback on classroom resources, deliver one module of learning to colleagues, and attend two workshops. And that was a really good opportunity to talk to other teachers then because for me, I'm really interested in the primary high school integration but it was lovely to face to face talk to some high school teachers about the materials and how they're using them. If you have a person participating in it that is willing to share it with the rest of the school and do the hard yards of helping other teachers learn, then it's really very effective. I think when we stop being learners, we stop being the best teachers we can be. One of the students today used the word puzzle, which is really interesting because puzzles are fun, whereas work is work. Teaching students not just to learn, but to love mathematics. What's your favourite subject in the day? Uh, probably math. Math. Yeah. And create the next generations of problem solvers.